So we took out the transmission off the Mitsubishi Evo MR, the SST transmission. So we're about to rebuild it right here. So there's going to be a, quite a few tools you'll be needing to take this apart. So to start, we're going to remove this one right here. And to do that, you'll need a, hope you can see in the camera, a T30. And that's to remove that part. Now we could remove this. So it's got this indentation down here where the starter would go. And here you could just pry it open with a tool like a flathead or an angle flathead. Just go in there. But we want to want to be careful so it won't damage this cover right here. So let's try to pry this open. And I'll be using this uh, Pittsburgh. Yep. There you go. See that? There it goes. And just a little bit of scarring there from the tool. Put that there. So now you're left with this. So in order to take that out, you would need to take out... Um, let me see. How you'll need a flat head to remove this ring if you can see this little ring so you'll have to find where the edge is which is right here so just lift that up and it'll take it out of the um, assembly so it took a while to get there so what I had to do is get another flat head so with this bigger one I was prying it up and with this one I was just pushing it out this way and while I was doing that just push it up and it goes out of this little groove. So you have all these little other grooves that's come out. So we'll try to rotate it. Right here. And pry it out. Like that, like so. And you see right there, it already popped out. So, it's a little bit difficult. And again, we'll try to pry it out. There it goes. Rotate. Again, same thing. Pry it out. Bring it around. Bring it around again. And there you go. And now you're left with 
<laughs> this assembly. So you can take it out like this. And sometimes on this transmission, they, they'll say, well, on this, um, grab what you call this assembly. They'll say that. Get to see if it's got any shakes or rattles. We'll see. Yeah. It might be broken, but we'll have to open it up and see, find out what was broken. So we have to uh, take it apart, replace the parts in there. Yeah. So now we'll jump into this right here. Take off this. Now let's see. It shouldn't be too hard, but. So now we're gonna take this assembly out. Put it to the side, and we'll take the next one out. Okay. Now, to take this out, uh, usually they'll, they'll use like a special tool, but since we don't have that tool, we could probably use the flathead. And just like hammer it to the side, and we'll see how that goes. So now what we're gonna do, we're just gonna hammer this with the with a flathead, see? This one, probably this one slot. We're gonna just hammer this to the side to loosen that up. And there it goes. It's loose. And that's it. So I'll take this out, you can use like hangers of some sort. They have a special tool, but you can just use like regular cloth hangers just to take this out. Or your hands. Uh, you see, I want to be careful with this because sometimes there's a ring that goes in there. Let's see if I can get it out. So this ring right here, you don't want to lose that part, that's a, so you just put it back here, like so, and I don't have a press so I'm going to have to take it somewhere to uh, have it uh, open up, just see what, what's inside on here, but yeah, so we're going to be replacing this whole parts that are in here, I have a set of, uh, what would be the, the steel plates and the clutch plates and hopefully my error goes away now the error I have I believe is a P1874 which is pressure abnormal too so I feel like I'm gonna open up the transmission on this one like I'm doing so just to figure out just to see what's going on now I don't know if that's normal right here you see that So I might need a new, yeah, I'm gonna have to call to see, but that's, I don't think that's, <laughs> I don't think that's good, um, but yeah, we'll see. I'll call uh, a few transmission places here, like uh, Jack's Transmission, since they're more professional on these things, and we'll see what they say. So the weight of the transmission is towards the back, so it's like leaning um, that way. So now in order to take most of these apart, we'll need um, a tool to get it out. Okay. okay, so we took the ring, if you see there. So now we can get this one out. You see it's got a little groove on there, so... There, you can see it where it's gonna sit. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take all these other bolts, and now we'll see which one. Not that one. Let's see. It's probably the same one I've been using. We'll see if it's this one. Okay. Yeah. 
So it'll be the same tool t uh, T30 for this one to take all these out. And that should do it. So for next video, I'll do one taking out this and also the mechatronic unit that's in there, the valve assembly with all the, mostly all the solenoids and, and electronics. All right.